This is a microchip. When you zoom in, you find a nanoscopic computing city. Skyscrapers hundreds of layers tall with hundreds of kilometers of wires connecting everything. And at the very bottom is this. Transistors. Billions of them. They are the ones and zeros of our computer. The chip works by whizzing electrons from transistor to transistor. And the smaller you can make those transistors, the less the signals have to travel, so the faster they can compute. So for over 50 years, transistors got smaller and smaller, and the number you could fit on a chip doubled every two years. This became known as Moore's Law, named for Intel's co-founder Gordon Moore after he noticed the pattern back in 1965, and it's been one of the main drivers of the tech industry. But around 2015, progress came to a screeching halt. If it wasn't for a single company that makes these machines, the machines that saved Moore's Law. Holy! This is a video about the most complicated commercial product humanity's ever built. That's insane! It costs a whopping $400 million, and it is so bizarre that I want to introduce it to you with a thought experiment. 